amazing to consider that I'm holding in my hands the place where someone once felt, thought, and loved, but not loved. For centuries, scientists have been battling to understand what this unappealing object is all about. The battle's about. What the object is all about. Here is this map of Jesse. You can hold in the palm of your hand. And it can contemplate the vastness of interstellar space. Contemplate the vast, contemplate the vast brain has evolved from the inside out. Its structure reflects all the stages through which it has passed. Information in the form of energy streams in simultaneously through all of our sensory systems in the form of energy. And then it explodes into this enormous collage. It appears rather gruesome, rather 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 wrinkles like a walnut, and with the consistency of mushroom, but mushrooms growing up with this like a walnut. Oh no. Included in cells called neurons, and cells called neurons. There are something like a hundred trillion neural connections. This intricate and marvelous network of neurons has been called an enchanted moon. An enchanted moon. The neurons store sounds to snatches of music. Whole orchestras play inside our canvas. Million volumes worth of information is inside the heads of every one of us. The brain, brain is a very big place, a very small space. Information in the form of energy streams in simultaneously through all of our sensory systems in the form of energy. And then it explodes into this enormous collage. No longer at the mercy of the reptile brain, we can change ourselves to think of the possibilities. Using your brain as a newspaper, think of all the information you can store, but it doesn't take up too much room, because it's all thing of all the information you can store. We see you with the eyes, but we see you with the brain as well. And seeing the flame is often called imagination. Imagination. The brain can contemplate the last brain. The brain is evolved in successive things. It is the most mysterious part of the human body, and yet it dominates the way we live our adult lives. It is the brain.